Palingenesis Manufacturing Incorporated was formed in the Philippines in 2004 after two previous years of research and development in Spain and the UK. The first full-size demonstration plant was manufactured in Tunisan, capable of processing up to 50 metric tons of municipal solid waste per day. This machine has now been operational for seven years. Unsorted waste is carried to the hopper which feeds the shredder. The waste drops down onto a bar shredder where blunt blades grind it into particles of less than 15 millimeters. The shredded waste is then conveyed to a series of vibrating sieving screens which further segregate biodegradable constituents from non-organic matter. The biodegradable waste is filtered to a particle size of between 3 to 12 millimeters, which is then carried to a station for conversion into soil enhancer or other products for the horticultural and agricultural industries, or for the manufacture of pellets for use as a fuel substitute or additive. The non-organic waste with a particle size of between 12 to 15 millimetres is conveyed into the mixing tanks where proprietary liquid additives are introduced. These chemicals render the waste non-toxic and inert and produce a thoroughly blended, homogenised amalgam. At this stage, wet and dry scrubbers effectively remove all dust and gases produced during the mixing and ozone is generated and added to eliminate any foul odours which may remain. After the material has been systematically mixed for about 10 minutes, the solid additives are added. These materials, sand, cement and lime, are blended for a further period of approximately 3-4 to four minutes to ensure that they completely bind and stabilise the waste. When this stage is completed, the material is carried via a conveyor belt to a further hopper which feeds the form-making machine. We initially installed hollow block making machinery, producing approximately three to four hollow blocks every 30 seconds or so, depending on the size of the product. A variety of sizes and shapes of blocks or paving slabs or similar can be made depending on the market requirements of the end user and a selection of merchandise can be supplied from one machine by simply changing the mould. A 50 metric ton machine is capable of manufacturing approximately 8 to 10,000 hollow blocks per day during a single 8 hour shift. The blocks are set aside to dry for 24 hours, after which they are stacked for curing. 
With the addition of hardness, the curing can take less than the traditional 28 days. Depending on the vase feed and the proportion of solid additives, the compressive strength ranges from 200 psi, 1.4 megapascals, to over 1421 psi, 9.8 MPa. The strength may be increased or decreased for individual requirement by simply altering the proportions of solid additives. As a result of this process, the end products are fire resistant, waterproof and insect repellent. Toxicity Characteristic Leaching Procedure this is a protocol used by the USA, which tests for leaching toxins from concrete submersed in water. These tests proved in all cases that the heavy metals originally present in the waste feeds were neutralized and stabilized, and that the leaching was under the required levels of acceptability. In the more stringent SPLP, Synthetic Precipitation Leaching Procedure, which replicates the effect of acid rain on concrete, the results prove that in most cases the leaching was contained to within the levels required for drinking water quality. All palingenesis machines are approved for export to the European Union and the rest of the world. Inspections were carried out by CE proof directives from the United Kingdom. All materials tests were carried out and verified by globally recognised laboratories and results are available to interested and qualified parties. Thank you for listening.